It's time to see Big John Masmanian's 1941 Willie's Gasser on What's in the Box? What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in this box? What's in the box? Hello everybody, welcome back once again, and it's time for some drag racing, drag racing, drag racing, with our Big John Masmanian's 1941 Willie's Gasser. Now, let's go down to the drag strip and strip the top off this box and see what's in it. And we'll go to Drag City because it's two, two, one. All right, now we're going to take a look at Big John Maz's Man's 41 Willie's Gasser. And to start with, this kit is a real beauty. We're just going to take the lid off it and take a look. So here we have our instructions for the Willie's Gasser. It gives you some history and, and how uh, Big John was able to get the car up to 159 miles an hour on the drag strips back in the 1960s. And there we've got the engine detail going together with a gigantic blower. This looks to be a Ford 429 or something similar. And then, of course, our interior, the single racing seat and roll bar. And then we have our frame underneath with these great big ladders for supports on that rear axle to hold up all the torque. And you see how long the supports go. They're shackled right up on the frame there. Of course, we've got a dropped axle with disc brakes, which would be quite innovative in the 60s when most of the brakes were drums. There's our wheels and tires going on and all the nice detail bits you get for that engine to keep it cool. And there's some templates for using windows and of course body going on. And they even give you a photo etched grill in this kit. So quite a nice little model. And there's our back with the decal instructions. And you get a nice little Ravel newsletter for 2001. Boy, I can hardly wait. <laughs> you get to see all the other things that were coming out at that time. Don't forget to check out Ravel online now to see what's coming out in our times. And then here, of course, we have our decal sheet. Some nice gold on there for Big John. And there's our photo etched grill. Now in order to glue on photo etched grills, of course, you need to use some crazy glue. All right, I'm going to move the box out of the way. Now, <laughs> everything comes in one great big bag. So this is going to be interesting to open. Well, Ravel was kind enough to actually just fold the bag over and use some tape. So maybe I can just cut the tape here. There we go. Hooray! <laughs> the bag was not sealed from top to bottom. Oops. Oh! And inside the box here I just found our clear plastic for the windows. That would be to cut them out for that template. Okay, move that out of the way. And we have our red tinted glass here. Which is a tinted glass was a 60s thing. Well, tinted glass is still going, but I mean red tinted glass. <clears throat> and here's our wheels, some wheel fronts and backs, as well as not a lot of chrome in this kit, actually. Oh, sorry, there's two chrome, chrome uh, sprues. Okay, there's the frame and those nice ladder rails. Then we've got our great big, huge engine to power the car.
There's our little red tail lights. The Willys had really tiny tail lights. And there's our interior. Now it's pretty nice and smooth in here. Not too much uh, detail like in the AMT 40 Ford Woody. But then again, the drag cars were basically quite simplified because anything would be considered weight, you know, like carpets and whatnot. So they tended just to make simple dashboards out of steel and that sort of thing. So it is accurate, even though the detail is not there. The same kind of detail is not there. Here's the second part of the chrome tree. And there's a nice grill you can put in here if you don't want to use the photo etched one. That's the typical 41 Willys grill. Yeah, these are definitely Ford, <coughs> Ford 427, 428 type of uh, cylinder heads. Now that's interesting, the air cleaner right in the middle there like that. And then we've got some pretty neat tires. I mean, that's pretty big, thick, slick. And then our little front skinnies. And, and finally, you can take a look at the body here. Very nice. I always like the Willys Coupes. They're tiny, but they are cool. And this hood that should open. Yep, there we go. A couple little tabs here. There we are. So that would click into place, and then if you ever want to open the hood, you just pinch the sides here. It should work. And there it is. And that concludes our look at the 41 Willys Dragster, Big John Mazden Mania. All right, wasn't that fun, fun, fun? I hope you enjoyed this uh, Big John Mazmanian's 1941 Willys Gasser. And I know I said Mazmanian wrong when I opened up the box. Shame on me. But if you've missed some of our videos from the past, please check them out here, here, and down here. And don't forget to like and subscribe to us by clicking over here. And we will see you next time on Monster Hobbies What's in That Box!